I think more shock and dauntingness was more the feeling I felt. But um, it was, uh, the thing is, it's, um, I, I think I was on such a high anyway, and so was Catherine about George, that really we were happy to show him off to whoever wanted to see him. As any new parent knows, you're only too happy to show off your, your new child and you know, proclaim that he's the best looking or the best everything. So you were comfortable there? Yeah, I, I felt, again, it was, it's, it's not somewhere I enjoy being, mm. but I know that in the position I'm in, that's what's required of me to do. And I think it's, um, it, you know, it's one of those things. And I, I'm, you know, it's nice that people want to see, see George. So, uh, you know, it was, I'm just glad he wasn't screaming his head off the whole way through. That moment when you came out with a car seat, I mean, we had some warning that you might be doing that. <laughs> Fathers around the planet will be um, cursing you for doing it so easily. <laughs> Believe me, it wasn't my first time. And I know there's been speculation about that. I had to practice, I really did. I was terrified that I was gonna do some, uh, you know, it was gonna fall off or <laughs> the yeah. door wasn't gonna close properly. So I had actually practiced with that, with that seat, but only once before. And your decision to drive off, I remember that moment as well. That was the most nerve wracking thing for me, having my family in the car. But that was something that you were clearly determined to do. Where I can be, I'm as independent as I, as I, as I want to be, and, and same as Catherine and Harry. We've all grown up, um, you know, differently to our uh, other generations, and I very much feel if I can do it myself, I want to do it myself. And there are times when you can't do it yourself, and the system takes over, or it's appropriate to, to do things differently. But I think driving your son and your wife away from from hospital when they just had a born, it was really important to me, and, and I, I don't like fuss, so it's much easier to do it yourself. And you didn't stall? I didn't stall, well, it's automatic, so it's all right. The interpretation of the imagery we saw there, which went around the world, was that this was a, a modern monarchy and a new way of monarchy, but was it that? Are we reading too much into it? Is it just you doing it your way, you and your wife doing it your own way? I think so, and I, I'm just doing the way I know, and you know, if it's the right way, then brilliant. If it's, not the, wrong, if it's the wrong way, then, well, I try and do it better. But um, no, I just, I'm quite, um, I'm reasonably headstrong about what I believe in and what I go for, and I've got fantastic people around me who give me great support and advice. Well, yeah, he's a, he's a little bit of a rascal, let's put it that way. So he either reminds me of my brother or me when I was younger, I'm not sure. But um, he's, uh, he's doing very well at the moment. He's, he does like to keep having his nappy changed, and, and you did the first nappy? Before. I did the first nappy, yeah, exactly. A badge of honour. Well, it's a badge of honour, exactly. Um, I wasn't allowed to get away with it. I had every midwife staring <laughs> at me going, you do it, you do it. He's a little, um, he's growing quite quickly actually, but he's a little fighter. He kind of, um, he wriggles around quite a lot and he, he doesn't want to go to sleep that much, which is a little bit of a problem. But he's... Uh, up a lot at night. A little bit, yeah. Time. Not as much as Catherine, but, um, you know, she's, uh, she's doing a fantastic job. How is she, okay? Yes, yeah, very well. And how are you about going back to work? Well, as a few fathers might know, I'm actually quite looking forward to going back to work now. <laughs> Get some sleep. Get some sleep, exactly, yeah. So I'm just hoping the first few shifts I go back, I don't have any night jobs.
at this rate, I'll probably whisper sweet nothings in his ear. I'll have p toy elephants and rhinos around the room. We'll cover it in sort of, you know, lots of bushes and things like that, and make him grow him up as if he's in the bush. <laughs> Oh, love it to me, very nice to see you. <laughs> I think the last few weeks for me have been just a very different emotional experience, um, something I never thought I would feel myself. And I find, again, it's only been a short period, but a lot of things affect me differently now. <laughs> oh, wow. oh, you're very sweet. <laughs> Maar is niet, dat is wat dat daar street worden of wat? Kom, zeil nog op de nek.